Then we have multi-threading. Multi-threading has two different areas of context. Actually, there's more than that, but we're going to focus on two different areas of context. One area is subdividing a process into two or more sub-processes or threads and executing them at the same time on one or more CPUs. If you take a process, and this one process may involve, let's say, a word processor. The processes may be reading a file, spell checking a file, and grammar checking a file. Now, obviously, you read the file first, and then you move into the checking modes. It's possible to spell check and grammar check a file at the same time, just for one example. One way you may approach this project is to break down the spell checking and grammar checking sub-processes into threads. If you only have a single or uniprocessor machine, then each one of those threads will be getting a specific time slice, and each one's going to be sharing the CPU to completion. If you have multiple CPUs, you could actually have one CPU doing the grammar check and another CPU doing a spell check at the same time. Another context for multi-threading is allowing multiple users to access the same shared process, each with its own local data space. Now in this context, let's go back again to the word processor. You might have multiple users on the same machine, all executing word processing functions. Well, you don't want to have that word processor loaded into memory multiple times, so the actual instructions are loaded once into memory, and everybody shares the same code. Even though they're sharing the same code, each user would have their own local data space, so the file they're editing would be local and private to that one user but they're sharing the same set of instructions. That's pretty much what multi-threading covers. In common use these days, we have multitasking, multi-processing, and in many cases, multi-threading machines all built into one. So most modern machines are going to support all three of the capabilities that we've just covered.